What's going on, everybody? Welcome back. We're doing a Vintage Cube here. Guys, I want to mention something before we get started here. Even though the draft will undoubtedly fire before I'm able to say all of it. I noticed that I've been getting saltier during some of my matches, and no one has said anything about this. I haven't been called down on it. I haven't been, like, criticized about it on YouTube or anything. It's just something I feel. And I think it's due to, like, you know, the mana issues and... um. I think I just put a lot of stock in winning games. You know what I mean? So, like, if I'm losing, I kind of feel like I wasted my time or my draft or the entry. And it's a little frustrating. But also, like, there's more to it than that. There's more to the game than that. You know what I mean? There's more to the stream than that. So, like, I don't know. I'd like to try... And work on that a little bit. Because I do notice it. And I do like complain. And I do like notice they have it. They always have it. Or I'm always getting mana screwed. And I do, I do think those happen quite frequently. I don't think those are invalid complaints. But I would like to not have them be the end all be all. Of, of the matches. So hopefully. Oh that's why I stopped subbing honestly. Good to know. Unfortunate. And so you don't support see that's rough to hear though. Like you wouldn't you won't you won't support my content. But you I don't know. That's that's weird. Just like I feel like just say something then, like just say, hey. Yeah, I because I can't fix it if I don't know about it. So that's weird. I don't know. I took an Ulamog. Um. Yeah, the problem with taking a break, I would love to take a break, but like then I don't like it's it's tough. It's like really like uh it's it's hard. Like it's hard being on all the time or not letting like back to back to back losses get to you. It's really difficult. And like I mean it's 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 frustrating like if that if that's what hinges on people supporting me, you know, like that's rough to hear. Like hey, man, you got to keep a more positive attitude all the time after, you know, losing back to back to back to back you know, or else I won't support you. Like, that's hard to hear. I mean, it's just, that's the bottom line. Like, that's hard to hear. Spaghetti Toucher, thank you so much for the resub, buddy. <clears throat> I did take Sheldock there. Um, I don't know what we're doing here, but, you know, we're going to find out. We're going to gonna make it happen. And see, that's the thing. Like, I mean, like a lot of times, half the half the people are like, "I like the honesty. I appreciate that you you are emotional. Like that you don't like hide your emotions. That you do have a natural human response. Things like that, you know." So it's really hard to like. I mean, you literally can't please anyone. That's just how it goes, you know. But it's definitely hard to hear like, "Hey, I stopped supporting you because you got too frustrated at you know massive." losing sessions you know it's just hard um kind of like wanted to thrand i don't know we have ulamog i don't know this is this 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 whole conversation has kind of derailed me a little bit in the sense that like i'm not sure what our direction is right now but i also don't think we've committed to anything we can just take blight steel oh through the reach seems good Interesting. Like, are we ever casting Blightsteel? Like, it's weird because, like, we have one colorless creature and Blightsteel's an artifact. So Tinker works with this guy. And, like, Metal work Colossus works with this guy. But they don't necessarily work with Ulamog. I'm going to take Through the Breach. I think Through the Breach has less of a chance of coming back than Blightsteel. And Through the Breach is also a pretty sweet build around. Alright, well. Could just take Frost Titan, I guess. And we do have Sheldock, so we're probably going to be blue. 
Frosty TT. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, dear. I'll just take Frost Titan. Gruel Signet. Also a proge Progenitus. Progenitus does not uh, seem great with Ulamog. Or uh, with Through the Breach, unfortunately. I think we're just taking Gruel Signet here. Spellpierce is actually pretty decent, I think. I think it's probably better than Lightning Greaves. None of these cards are very exciting. Thank you. Frank, stay real. I don't want to watch a fake Frank hiding his true emotions. It's not about I wouldn't want to be I'm, I never want to hide them. I just want to be able to let them affect me less. You know what I mean? Like Uh, give me one. Thank you. Probably Bloodbraid Elf. Although we did just take a spell pierce. I'll take Welder. I think the upside is higher. Sushi and Sashimis. Thank you so much for the sub. Really appreciate it. None of these cards are great. I feel like our. I'll just take. I'll just take Lotus Cobra. I guess we're teamering here. If I unsub for myself every time I get salty, I'm just, yeah, I'd be dead. What is, wow, that's... Frank, when you get salty, it isn't even all that serious. I was just watching Russ Raymond the other day, and when his opponent had it all, he just said, Jesus Christ, can't you draw one? Oh, God. I try not to be that aggressive. That's aggressive. Um, I feel like we're just drawing. Okay, well... Okay. Well, we're just taking all the red... Co wow. Alright, so we're just kind of like mono red ramp, I guess. <laughs> what up, Chris? I'll say honesty is good, but it does cross my mind that if you're having a run of bad draws, lands are running a less complex than a draft. Well, that's, a, that's funny, because like that's what we kind of did yesterday with our... We had, like, basically a blue-white deck, but then, like, we still ended up, you know, just getting outdone as it were I'm using the turn up calculator thanks for recommendation Matt Season Rivers is here from the other stream I've listened to it it's such a good song dude I hope you get a good price man you guys are like You guys are like turn up entrepreneurs. The Blightsteel Colossus did not come back. What up, TPO? It's not looking so hot this week. <laughs> oh, Lord. 23 seconds. I have no idea. Oko seems fine. We have a girl signal. We have a shell dock. I mean, it's very good, right? We all know it is. Oh, Tropical Island? Oh, God, Mana Vault. Oh, God. <sighs> Jesus. Also, Michael B. said, I'll join you after work. You can't stop me. I will have that juicy Vintage Cube experience. <laughs> After you play my big red deck, my goals were fulfilled. I need to find a new goal of a junk deck for you to play. Oh, wow. Oh, goodness gracious. I'm just going to take the Tropical Island. I think it's better. Uh... Oh, followed by a Scalding Tarn. Oh, a Coalition Relic, too? God, why is there a really good artifact and a really good land in all these packs? I feel like it's got to be Tarn here, right? But then Coalition Relic. He's vomiting, guys. My shop is upgrading today, so I can't sell anything. And today was supposed to be my best price of 206 before it falls back down into the 60s for the rest of the week. Oh my god, this game is so intricate, dude. I'm going with Coalition Relic. Oh, now we're going to take uh, Tundra? 
Oh, Tundra. Yes. Oh, Venser. And a Preordain? I don't mind you venting or showing your frustration it happens to all of us, but if you're concerned about it affecting the mood of the stream, I would say to balance out the limited play with some constructed. Draft is fun, but it's also a more luck dependent. That's I, that's fair. That's actually a good... That's actually a really good suggestion. Smoky Loki, thank you, man. I appreciate you. And your support. And your beautiful face. Of which I've never seen. It's either Prude or Venser. Sir. Um... Prudent seems actually a lot better because with double blue, not not a thing. Control magic. I'll take control magic. Oh, Dryad of the Elysian Grove. That helps our colors. And we get to play two lands. I agree with the comment earlier about sticking into simpler decks if we get into Siren Moon like two colors or something. I'll stick you in a simpler deck. Got her. Such wreck. No, I'm just kidding. I won't do that. Buy you dinner first? Okay. I'll do that. Okay. I'm going to take just a Finky Reno. Fink, Finky Roos. I don't think it's Seething Song. Although I did once... Um, I did once go Seething Song into Goblin Dark Dwellers. Flashback Seething Song through the Breach Emrakul. And that was a pretty sweet turn. So I'm going to take the Seething Thank Song. Oh, oh, we're doing it. We're living that dream, my dudes. Rogue Optic Dev, thank you so much for the resub, buddy. Really appreciate it. What if some of us enjoy salt? Well, then you're in the right place for sure. Oh, man. We also have just preordained for this guy right now. Dang. I'm going to take it because if we hit like Ancestral or Time Walk in our last pack. Show and tell. I do like a show and tell, but you know what I like more than a show and tell? Every other card in the cube. Got him. I'm going to take Ancient Grudge. Ancient Grudge is almost like main deckable in this format. I managed to create an arena playable Song of Creation deck full of draw spells and cycles. Katie, should I take the Thrag Dusk? Four Jaces to win if I draw the whole deck and Ominous Seas to turn all those draws into 8 8 crack. Good lord, man. Maybe you need to stream. Katie, I don't have, I don't know if you know this, but I don't actually have a Switch. So I couldn't stream Luigi's Mansion. Mm. 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 All right, we're looking for fixing here for sure. Shrine can come out, Welder can come out. This is a very weird deck right now. Oh. <gasps> We gotta pass the volcanic, but we're taking the time walk, especially with the darky boys. Oh yeah, that's nice. That's what we're talking about. I prefer the streams with Mike B. I like the banter and communicate. Oh yeah, I agree. I I don't disagree. I think having a second person is always awesome because you can bounce things off of them. You know, it's like uh, it's like listening to a podcast with two people instead of listening to a podcast with one person, right? Like it's it's a totally different experience. I'm gonna take breeding pool. I would take Renin Six, but we already uh, we don't have any uh, fetchy boys. I'm gonna take Breeding Pool. Oh, what up, Elk Tears? <laughs> it's Elk Tears from NYC. Oh man, that's wild. Oh, Stomping Ground. All right. So now we have Stomping Ground, Tiger Breeding Pool, Tropical Island. I mean, in a perfect world, the... Uh... Oh, Arid Mesa gets... Well, just just red and green. But it's still probably the pick in this pack that's not very impressive. So I'll take it. Yeah, Rob has been trying to get me to do a podcast for a while. Okay, here's a thought. Let me know what you guys think in YouTube or, or in the in the Twitch comments, whatever. Uh, Rob and I actually want to restart Freshly Brewed. But it would be me and Rob. And we asked Ollie, and Ollie seems... Well, Ollie seems totally fine with the idea. Um, but we would just restart Freshly Brewed as, as, as Rob and I. Um, I'm pretty sure I'd just take Fractured Identity here. <laughs> and we splash it off of Arid Mesa slash Coalition Relic slash Dryad Lotus Cobra. That seems pretty good. 
Yeah, Woodfall Primus is not bad with Through the Breach, to be quite honest. But my problem is that it's such a it's such a thing to set up. Like I have to re go into like I have to like submit it to Spotify. I have to submit it submit it to Stitcher. I have to submit it to. We have to figure out a way to record it. We have to rebrand it. Put it on iTunes. Like there's so many things to do with the podcast. Like and and my biggest concern was that like when I was doing the previous podcast with Ali, like I was the one doing. Um, I hate to say it, a lot of the work. Like I was doing, I was naming the podcast, I was writing the description, I was editing it, I was uploading it, uh, I was paying for the uh, the hosting fees, you know. Like I was, I was the one post, I was posted to social media. Like I did, I did most of the work for our podcast. Um, and so that was a big like. It, it was a big deterrent for me because I was just, it was just hard. It was hard to do all of the, like all of that, all of that, that work for the podcast along with all the other stuff I was doing for the week, you know, isn't pod band. Ain't nobody casting that. God dang. Oh, fiery confluence. You are a fan favorite. This deck is weird, but I actually don't hate it. I, if I edited the song to, oh wow that's great when we have oh wow that's fantastic if I edited the song to say Rob instead of uh, Ollie hold on <coughs> I would do it I would do it comedically and so it's noticeable right like it would be like freshly brewed with Rob and Frank you know like I would make it sound like super ridiculous on purpose I actually like Temple Garden here because uh, we can now we can get it with Arid Mesa and it prevents us from having to have just the stupid planes in the deck for fractured identity. That's actually pretty nice. Um, Char is fine, I guess. Oh, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna hate this. We need one more playable here. And we could just play Garrick. I mean, again, it's pretty easy to splash off of. Wow, that's a late time spiral and a late high tide. Jeez. Thank you. Risa, thank you so much for the Risa, buddy. Really appreciate it, my dude. Risa, I still have your obviously I still have your stipulation. If you wanna um if you wanna adjust it for the vintage cube, let me know. Did we not take the blood braid off? I thought we did. Oh well. I wonder if this is enough for Eureka. Like this, 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 and this. These are both cast triggers, but this is entering the battlefield. I actually love Through the Breach with Woodfall Primus. It's probably one of my favorite things. Elk Tears guest on the stream Tuesday on the 27th. Matt, I would... That, would, that sounds awesome, dude. How can we do it? The same way? Do you want to... How's your internet connection? I assume it's fine. I feel like Ancient Grudge in the main deck is actually just fine. We could do Seething Song, actually. I'm the only one with Bikati, that's true, and I love you. But... Your internet's so bad. It's only it's only bad for like two more months, my love, and then we'll, and then we'll be fine. It's a real piece of shit. <laughs> How's your internet, man? It's 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 actual garbage. Oh man, that'd be hilarious. Me and me and Matt together again for the first time. Matt, do you not have a webcam? Would you not be would you not be visually on the stream? Oh, if you don't have a green screen though, it's not the same. Because otherwise, like you'd have a background. Can you just go over to Dan's house and then it can be me, you, and Dan's, and then we got we can all just green screen it? Yeah, if you can get her green screen in this in a safe fashion. 
Or you can just do it from her place. Like, that works, too. I don't know if it's Seething Song or Ancient Grudge is the 23rd card here. Or we can take out one of these dudes. Probably Siege Gang Commander and just add the Seething Song. Seething Song on turn three into, like, Through the Breach or Dark Dwellers into Seething Song. Yeah, I think that's actually pretty good. All right. Our mana base has actually turned out pretty good. All right, what do we got here? Red, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, that's fine. Blue, we have three. Arid Mesa, you get no blue, unfortunately. So three, four, five, six, seven. Green, we have two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yep, that seems good. Plus, we have Gruel Signet, Coalition Relic, etc. Oh, biscuits. I will play first. I'm afraid of Americans. We'll keep this hand. Through the Breach could be very good. If we draw Woodfall Primus or, like, Ulamog. Tuesday is the 28th. Unbelievable. It's a Jiraga tree. Speak here. Uh, can we get Ulamog the Infinite Euro? Fashion relate to the party, Shelly. That's still fine on turn three. Because we can still play uh, Seething Song through the Breach Shell Dock. Come on. One time. Woodfall Primus or Infinite Gyro. One time. Okie dokie. Coalition Relic. I actually don't hate Seething Song for five. Coalition Relic. Um, oh, we can't play Oko off of that, though. Dang, that's tricky. Ugh, we kind of give them a turn. Five for this, three for this. Then we have two red and a coalition relic. Yeah, it's just not... There's no way to do that. This is our only land for the turn, so... I feel like that's... How are we going to keep... The, I mean, like we can't play Frost... I'm not going to throw the Breach of Frost Titan. That seems pretty bad. Oh, there's a Woodfall Primus. God, Woodfall Promise or Fractured Identity here? Jeez. What are you guys saying right now? Fractured Identity, I guess, sort of anything. Woodfall Promise. I think it's got to be Fractured Identity, right? Any order. All right. I 
I've had David Bowie's I'm Afraid of Americans stuck in my head for like a year. I'm afraid of Americans. Oh, geez, a swamp. Oh, God. Polychronos? Be something... <sighs> okay. Well, here we go. Show me what you've got. This seemed less impressive. <laughs> All right. And game two. Cobra. Cobra. Uh, let's add a green. Let's tap down their derogatory speaker. Hey, little biscuits, get in there with your frosty boy. After I played Frost Titan, they were like, nothing. And I was like, Oko, and they're like, nothing. And I was like, I see. Alcatiers was so ahead of his of his time with his name. Good gravy. Here comes a maelstrom. Dark ritual. Okay. Vivian Reed. Harmonize, sure. Bomat. Sorry, I, I just think I'm too stupid to understand this. This does not seem very good. <laughs> what? You're gonna end this whole man, this man's whole career. Career. <laughs> See, that's funny. See, that's comedy. All right. All right, we're just gonna draw an, an Ulamog here and call it a day. I think. Garrick Relentless. Okay, that seems fine with me. Two, three, four, Gary. Actually, I should have used this and then turned this into a three, three. That would have been the pro play. Let's tap, let's kill you. Flip you, boy. Garrus. Do you just attack for eight Zs? I'm really regretting not making this a thing.
Ah, yeah, keep this idiot tap. No blocks? You got big plans for this courier? Wow, what is happening right now? I have three cards. I don't get it. Is Vintage Cube online? No, nah, this is just a trick. I don't know. I, I I sooner assume that I don't that I don't understand what's going on, than that my opponent is bad or not good. That's. Yeah, it's got to be a tinker. That's that, that that's the only thing that makes any sense whatsoever to have a bow mat. Okay. Oh god. I mean, we're, they're at a point where they can't ooh, they can't draw eight cards, and their guys can't get haste with a blooming. Okay. They put Shriek Maw and Emrakul in the graveyard. And then they conceded. Huh. You know, I'll be honest with you. I kind of want this Garrick in here. Because we can still cast it off of Lotus Cobra off of Dryad and off of Coalition Relic, but it's also good if they want a Eureka. Take Ancient Grudge out. We didn't see anything for an Ancient Grudge. How's the new Garrick in the cube? Oh, man, I'm a fan of that meme. You know what? I'll keep this hand. It's not very exciting, though. Eh, maybe. I don't know. Can we get a more exciting hand than this? Probably. Fire Confluence does seem good, though. I'll give it a shot. Green deck, no turn one play. Let's get a Tumble Garden before it's too late. I have no issue with the with the dual lands whatsoever. I think they look totally fine. Now I feel good about this. All right, next turn we can dryad, play a second land, and then we can fractured identity. After that, I'm okay with all of it. Hey there, discard player mesmeric fiend. I'll discard blight steel colossus. Mm. Pack rat, I got a fiery confluence, boy. Do 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 do. Mm -hmm. Dryad of the Elysian Grove. 
I feel like our hand is pretty well positioned against them right now, to be honest with you. Oh, what up, Aceru? Make sure I can't play any more lands. Basic land, island, swamp, forest, mountain, plains. That seems like a really random order. Plains is last. Forest is before mountain. That's a very strange order for those lands. Swamp, island, mountain. Swamp, island, plains. Weird. I'll block. And then I'll fire your confluence, your rat. Oh, that's unfortunate. Well, now I do need a red. They did not attack. Strategy, Cotton. Let's see if it pays off for him. Acer, thanks for saying so. Yeah, if you guys haven't done so, definitely check out my article this week on cool stuff. I'll link it for you here. It's about companions. It's about the companion conundrum. Gary. Gary! And go leave a comment on the article, too. Leave a comment. Use promo code FRANK5 to get 5% off. Do all, all the things that you do when you're trying to support your friends. You for, you support your friends' content. Do all the things that you do. Do it all. Oh, Black Lotus. Oh, we're going to sack, 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 black, sack black. Here comes a shield red. I'm just going to steal it. I'm going to fractured identity it. And then our opponent's going to be like, well, now I'm miserable. Because they can, like, acidic slime this or something, but if we just fractured identity it. When I'd make YouTube videos, I'd always say on the social post, comment on... I'd say I on the social post, comment on the video, and sure enough, full conversation... Yeah, that's always... That dude happens all the time. Where I'm like, hey, guys, make sure you comment on the article itself so that I can get, uh, you know, so that it's, it looks good, right? Like it's, uh, can we play both? One, two, three, four, Thranny boy. Because it's good engagement, right? But then everyone's like, I'm going to comment on this Facebook post instead. And I'm like, oh, no, don't do that. <laughs> Create a wolf. Do, 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 do. Wolf is black. The heat is on. Psycho creature, you don't have any guys. Oh, they conceded. All right. Well, this is an interesting match that I have no idea. I have no idea what happened. Boo -doo 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 -doo. <sighs> All right, let's do it again. I couldn't comment because I don't face well biscuits. That seems wild to me in 2020, not have just not having a Facebook. Like, even if you don't check Facebook or scroll through Facebook, like Messenger is like one of those common ways to just communicate with people. Yeah, see, Ben, I knew you didn't have one, and that's just, it's just weird to me, I think. I just don't think, like, the, I think the impact, like, the negative impact on your life to, like, not have one is higher than, or, uh, is lower than the positive impact. 
like having ease of communication would be Let's see what happens here uh phew, wow infinite artifacts i'll take thran dynamo i guess I'm just gonna play low, low, low tie cobra, and then we're gonna hope we draw. Actually, we could play Garrick next turn. I guess that's pretty good. Oral, thank you so much for the reset, buddy. Welcome back. I, I still have Oral. I still have your original step of hindsight 2020. Redo your favorite step of the last decade. We do it better this time. I couldn't think of one, so I just hadn't hadn't done it yet. But I did. I never forgot. I never forgot. I'm gonna get in there. They're probably not gonna block, which is fine. Yep. All right. Let's. Uh, I'm eating mango. That sounds delicious. My God. My God. Make a wolf. Ow. Oh man, ancient grudge main deck boy. Get him. Oh, yeah, we got him. So if we save this for next turn, we can play one of our five drops. I'm just going to put it in play. Uh, no. I guess we could have also camped up. Okay. But Ancient Grudge. Oh, bitter blossom. Put it in the graveyard. Alright. Well, these matches have been something. Scoop them up. Guys, Ancient Grudge in, uh, in Vintage Cube. Don't sleep on it. Boom ba ba boom ba ba boom ba ba boom 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 ba ba da ba dum ba ba dum ba ba dum boom boom Sometimes you always have it. It's true. But it is really random obscure cards like Spell Pierce and Ancient Grudge, so yeah, I'll keep this hand. Also, Thunderbolt Hellkite's surprisingly good against uh, Bitter Blossom. Oh, boy. Scry 2. Through the Breach and Fractured Identity? God, I want both of these. I want to put you on the bottom. I'll put you on the top for sure. I'm tempted to just time walk here, but it's got to be better when we have, like, Thundermile out, right? But it does let us just go Coalition Relic, counter on Coalition Relic. Plus we have Dark Dwellers. I'm just going to do it. I think the I think the advantage is pretty high. Because next turn we just get 5 drop. Or Garrick. Or 6 drop. Captain America. Oh, don't be Rex aging me. That's fine. I don't care about all that. I might just steal that. 
All right, so you're drawing a swamp. Sounds good. Blue. So we could go, can we go one, two, Lotus Cobra? One, two, three, four, five. So they're drawing a swamp. Oh boy. Now we don't have to draw that next turn. And we get to draw, we do get to draw one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Well, we're not quite there yet. Unless we draw fetch land. Oh, fetch land off the top would be like. Thank you. Alan, what's, what is up, my dude? 59 months. Thank you so much, man. I love you too, buddy. I love you too, my dude. All right, so the swamp is gone. Harmonize. Oko McSchmoko. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven mana. One, two, three, four, five. Martino's delivery. <laughs> Thank you. I just gave birth, Frank, and it's your fancy art. Thank you so much. I'm so glad that we have our uh, nine month sub baby. Fractured identity, their stupid signet. That's not exciting. Thought I was in the old URL bar. <laughs> Aji boy, you are my favorite, dude. Oh, good gravy. What's up, my nerds? Um, one, two, three. I think we're just playing forest. I think we're just. I think we're just gonna thunder my hellkite here because YOLO. One, two, three, four, five, Thunder Maw Boy. And then I guess we just attack for nine. One, two, three, four, one, two, three. I'm about to start my flower garden in Animal Crossing New Horizon NH. See if I get some hybrid action going. I personally cannot. Okay. Well. Oko and Fractured Identity? Wait, how are they not dead here? Oh man, this is a real uh this is a real let people enjoy things moment. Uh good luck, I have a good garden going. <laughs> Frank, I need to add your friend code. I don't even have a switch, Brett. Uh let's just go blue here. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven mana. So they go to seven. They can go block, block. They go to four. I don't think we want to fracture identity of this. I also don't think we want to shut this off because we have fracture identity. Dude, I tried to get a switch last year, but Katie was like, well, don't get a switch. I have one, so we don't need two. And I was like, okay. 
And now she's like, I want to get you a Switch because then we can play Animal Crossing together. And I'm like, I could have got one last year when they were cheaper. Um, I think we just, we just make this a 3-3. I don't, I don't know, man. Yeah, let's just get in there, and then we have they have no good real trades here. Sure. So they have six turns to win. We have a fractured identity. I'm okay with it. I, I feel like they're going to go shield right here because that seems like my opponent's MO. Primus. They're going to get Oko, which is fine because then we get to fracture identity that dude. And then we just win the game, I presume. Oh, fiery confluence? Good gravy. <laughs> they're just like... Okay, Fiery Confluence kills me. Oh, wow, we are 2-0. <laughs> Oof. Rip your trophy shouldn't have said anything. It's true. Why didn't I get an elephant tongue? Because it wasn't... It's not Terastodon. It's a Woodfall, Woodfall Primus. Come on, Fancy Art. Get it together. This is why you can't raise our sub, baby. Seething song, oh boy! Oh, we have no, we have no lands. Yeah, this is a keeper. This is a keeper. The reason I put that guy back is because Through the Breach is less impressive with that Emrakul. Or Ulamog, rather. That ain't Emrakul. Sheldock. Yep, now we're just playing Grill Signet. Uh, Diet Coke, Katie. It is Diet Coke. Lime made? Do I care about their bird? Not really. I mean, 
I don't really want to give them a three through right now when I have no real way to deal with it. Cool. Seems good. All right. Ideally, we can hit another red source here because that would be ballin'. That'll do. I accept this as a red source that kills their bird and their Vraska in one fell swoop. Solid. Solid gone, daddy -o. Don't sleep on Seething Song, guys. It'll get you. I kind of just want to kill the Leovold here. So I think I'm going to do that. Because if they have like Twister in hand, it's... Well, it's good for them. And bad for us. If you draw another blue source, you just get to play Frost Titan, which is kind of cool. You got it. Three cards in hand. All right. Blue source. Wow, we're really good at this game. It's pretty wild. Also, the nice thing about uh, Fiery Confluence on Leovold is that they don't get to uh, draw a card. Um, let's tap your black source. I need a hero. Do 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 One, two, buckle my shoe. They go to one here? Wild. I can have this. I keep seeing like the stars ads for like $25 for six months. And I'm like, okay, but what do you guys have? Like, I don't even know what stars has one, two, three, four, five, six. All right. This is a, this is a game. Did they have any ancient grudgeable things? They did have a bird and a devoted druid. They have venom. Oh yeah. Good point. Mediocre Magic Man was all defending Venom. He was like, I liked it. It was a good movie. And I was like, no, it wasn't. He's like, no, he didn't say it was a good movie. He just said it was kind of mindless fun. And I'm like, I don't I don't disagree with that. 
but like there's a limit to like how much mindless fun like can be in the movie before i'm like removed from it you know like i think you can still have mindless fun like homecoming far from home like you can still have like comic book mindless fun um without making it like kind of like nonsensical you know that's that's just my my feeling i feel like polychronos is actually probably fine here I am a little scared of Leovold. Maybe I'll Char instead of Pelucranos. Char also hits, um... Any hopes for the next one? Not really, no. God dang, man. Through the Breach and Ulamog in the same hand. But where are my lands? Oh, come on. Going to five? Land, land. Seething Song. Through the Breach. Ulamog. Definitely keep. Definitely keep. We'll get rid of you and Stomper. All right. Well, we're on the draw. Preordain. It's not the bathe. Venom is better than all Spider movies. Change your mind? Nah. I don't have time. Why are you gonna counter my girl's remand? Oh boy. Trigon Predator. I guess I'll wait on the Fiery Confluence then. Or on the Girl Signet then. I really hope they play Leovold here. Because I'm making fiery confluence. Oh, do it, 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 I liked Venom. Oh, Katie. Oh, my love. Painful things to hear. One, two, three, four. So another drawing force. <laughs> Green Sun for three, getting a coarser of crew fix, I presume. <laughs> Your boy. Yep, Leovold is actually pretty good with a Frost Titan. I tap their thing. I think I counter my Thrag Tusk. Go to one card. Wow, they did? That's pretty wild. Unless their last card is Time Twister, which is pretty insane. I 
I mean, I'll let you draw the card. We gotta get rid of Leovold. Let's see what they play here. Nissa. Who shake of the world? One, two, three, four, five, six. Sure. It's very good. Turn two Cabal Ritual to cast Collective Brutality, discarding Shielder to Leshnorn. Kill the Goblin Guy, drain two, discard his bolt. Use the floating mana to reanimate Shielder in my next upkeep. She, Elder, she, she reanimates Elesh. I don't think I could have more thoroughly wrecked them. Yeah, that's pretty good. I wasn't sure if your opponent did that. I have two cards, we have none. So, I mean, it's not... Sure. Bear, dear, dear, dear. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight mana. And one card. Could be a land. <sighs> That's pretty annoying. So no cards in hand. Sounds good. Yeah, unfortunately, Fiery Confluence is in the graveyard. All right, well. Seems good. Solid top deck. Why you tapped all your green for that? I don't know. I guess you had to. One, two, three, four, five. Sure. Yeah, and we're going to top deck a... Uh, you know what it's called. Yeah, that's going to be game. Temple Garden into Dryad, Arid Mesa. Yeah, all right. Huh. Ancient Grudge still not looking great. You don't you don't kill Planeswalkers, unfortunately. P -p -p Planeswalkers. I mean, I just want to. I just want to through the breach, Woodfall Primus, or Ulamog one time. I don't think that's too much to ask. I'll keep it. If we hit that time walk, it's you. What does that? What does that even mean? It's a you. Hoo -hoo -hoo. Man, oh man. We can work at night by night. I actually think Dryad might be better here because it lets us put another land into play instead of... Uh... Hmm. 
I mean, they're probably just going to remand this, which is... Less... Oh, they did not remand this. Fascinating. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven mana. We can pretty much cast anything now. No, we can. We can literally cast everything. Sure. Create a food token. Oh, they do have force of will, though. Yep, that's not what we want to see, unfortunately. Yep. Green Sun for two. Sylvan Carry added? Wild. Okay. Come on, give me any one of those three fat daddies in the deck. Opposing? Oh, this is why we should have played Grill Signet. I feel like we can actually get rid of Coalition Relic at this point. I really just want to kill Oko. <laughs> and this will do that, so. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten mana. So we can still cast Woodfall and one Ulamog. The number of times Vraska has killed Oko is pretty comical. But she doesn't really do much else. She doesn't really do much elk. Okay. That's pretty good. Alright. You're gonna go face, you're gonna go Vraska, and you're gonna go Vraska. One, two, three, four, blue, blue, frosty boy. Tap down at your single blue so that you're a little more restricted. Frost Titan doing some work in this. Mm. 
Thank you. Are we trophying? Chicken run official. Thank you so much, buddy. Really appreciate it. 25 months, man. That's a little over three years. Oh my goodness gracious. This is how it looks to trophy your very first your very first thing. Didn't we have like mentor? Didn't we put mentor in here? Thank you guys for watching. Slam those like and subscribe buttons, guys. And uh before we go, I'm gonna open this uh Check me out at Cool Stuff Inc. every Wednesday. I have new articles go up. I just had one go, uh, go up called the uh, the Companion Conundrum. 35 play points. An easy prey avatar, which is adorable. And I'm probably going to use that now. And let's see what else we got. Oh, wow. Essence Symbiote Avatar, also adorable. And some more play points. Thank you guys for watching. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Check me out. On twitch.tv slash frankenport, patreon.com slash frankenport, coolstuffing and manatraders.com if you're looking for an awesome subscription service to borrow some of these sweet companions. Maybe they're not so sweet. And uh, you get 20% off the first three months of any subscription with the link and promo code down below. Be sure to use that, and I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching, guys.